Hi guys, and welcome to my new YouTube video. Today, I am going to be playing Abzan Angels. I kept trying to make Selesnia Angels work for me in Explorer, and I still just haven't really gotten there. So today, I'm going to be trying it again. It's basically the same thing, but now with Vita. So let's see if this new and improved version works for me. Ah, uh, we have a pretty good hand actually in terms of curve I think I'm gonna keep it so this is really interesting because angels is in fact a deck in pioneer that some people are playing I don't know if it's tier one but it's a list that I've enjoyed for a long time so I keep hoping that it's gonna work out for me in some form of explorer or pioneer I'm happy to be testing it again though Oh, this person might be playing abs and humans, which is interesting. I'm going to send it. If they want to block speaker, they can do so. They did not. Coco. Oh, no. It's not my fave. Probably should have played Redan. Womp womp. Now, however, I believe I will play Redan. My respondent angel is not really killing it for me right now without my righteous valk, though. Sad. Human, interestingly, Humans is a deck that I'm considering in Pioneer because I think it's a lot of fun. Um, I'm considering a Bant version and it doesn't run Katilda, but um, it's kind of cool to see this happen. That is a vampire. Ah, that's a bit rude. I wish they wouldn't. Not very nice. Okay, maybe I could like draw something. I guess I should play her now because technically I can activate her next turn. Another collected company. I wish they would not. I have that in my deck too, but I haven't drawn any. <laughs> this is not fair. <laughs> oh, fuck me. And I mean that with all due respect. We need to draw a collective company probably like right now and go ham. Um, maybe? Maybe we'll be okay? Let me think. Let me think about my life here. I can activate your Splendid Angel and gain five life. Make another angel. I don't know. God, my rank is low. I've been playing on MTGO recently. This is awkward. Nobody say anything. Shh. <laughs> okay, fine. I take six. Uh, I take ten. Uh, it's not my fave. Let's do it. I'm probably dead, but I'm gonna try. Let's see what I draw here. I guess if I draw a collective company, I won't activate Respondent Angel, but let's see. Uh, that's not it. That is really not it. I guess I could have used this as a blocker. I'll use the angel token that it's gonna make as a blocker. So they actually have the mana to do something out of hand. Kill my angel. Let's find out. They have two mana, technically, off of Catilda and Brutal Caesar. <laughs> okay. I forgot about that ability. Yep. I forgot that he could do that. And that is unfortunate, but it's okay. Get him this time. That was a, a really good starting hand after which we drew nothing. And they uh, exiled our creatures under Bull of Kaether, our important ones. So, you know what? I didn't like it. Let's try again. <laughs> uh, again, we have a really good curve. I think we will keep it. I don't like that I don't get to play the Triome, but I do have a turn one play, so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, we are gonna go ahead and play Giada. I think it's the right play. We drew the land we needed, so that's good. Things are looking good. I mean, obviously they could counter here. There are many things that could happen. They could stomp. Okay, they're just gonna counter it. Sure, that's fine. Now what? We're just gonna counter again? They're debating a play? Okay, the play is to kill Giada. Sure. Rude, but whatever. Okay, alrighty. We will go with... I probably should have played the Triumph, but I didn't. So be it. I could cycle it if I don't draw anything. Always an option. Ooh, that does seem fun. Let's try it. Can pay for a sensor. That's fine. They do have two treasure tokens, though. I will draw a card. Oh, it's a Coco. Um, I am just gonna play this tapped for now. Coco's a good hit. Okay, we might get, like, Magma Opus this next turn. Um, not my fave. Mizzix Mastery? Is it happening? I am gonna send it. Gear Hulk. Is it Gear Hulk? It's something. Whatever it is, I don't like it. Yeah, I'm smart. Yeah. I want to see what happens here. I want to let them do the damage, and then I can probably collect a company in maybe enough life 
to make my stuff bigger? Let's see. Let's find out. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I am gonna go for two useful Valkyries. That is in fact enough life. Yeah, feels good. <sighs> I didn't get baited. Now I'm probably gonna get board wiped, except I'm not running white, so. See, play smart. Play smart, my friends. Oh, I ranked up, that was easy. And again, mm. hand is like not as good. I think I think we will mull again. This is, uh, this is pretty decent. We're gonna get, get rid of Vito though. Goodbye Vito, I can't play you anyway. I think I'm actually gonna start with the overgrown farmland because Maybe I'll need the Visage you? I don't have a turn one play, so. Hello. Ooh, Mana Red, this should be a good match for me. We'll see. Okay, it's fine. Kaiza. I don't have a lot of life gain at the moment, which makes a Johnny like not as fun. <laughs> and gain three life per turn, which is not precisely helpful. And I will play this Temple Garden tap and I will swing with Jada because she has vigilance. Oh, they do have reach, but I have a ganjo, so it's fine. I guess I could just Seiju their etching. Seems good. <laughs> I'm just kind of using these lands for their alternate purpose, which is, which is great. When you have enough lands for pretty much your entire deck, I mean, I guess I can't activate Resplendent Angel, but you might as well use them for their alternate purpose. Ooh, Rampaging Frostodon. That's not fun. I'm going to cycle this because it can't gain life anyway. I will beat them down with Giada. Torbrun. Ayy. Um, that thing does five damage, so it can't kill both. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Um, hmm. We're going to Bishop and then swing Giada and then Righteous Valkyrie. Yeah, seems good. I feel like I can block, to be honest, unless they have like a trick in hand. It's not my favorite. They can only kill Bishop currently. They probably have a trick. What was the trick? Oh, that was the trick. Fine. Let's see what we draw here. Okay, we'll play the land. We'll play Johnny. I think we're gonna make the cat. Getting okay right now. Looking okay right now. It's fine. They're gonna rip it to do four to me. Hoping they draw I don't know, something. Um, I am gonna double block this. Oh, another one. Dang, that was kind of rude. Uh, Bishop. And then I am gonna make it cat again, I suppose. What's the plan? What's the plan, my friend? How are we getting out of this? Oh, a bone crusher giant. That's a little rude. That was not my favorite, but I gained a bunch more life off of a Johnny. <laughs> yeah, I think they realized their mistake. Nice. How many games was that? Three? Two? I don't remember. We'll play like, that was three. We won two. We'll play two more. All right. I feel pretty neutral about this hand. I think it's fine. Ooh, cool pet. We have three righteous Valkyries, which is pretty strong. Oh, fight rigging. I don't love that. We're gonna start with our first Righteous Valkyrie. This is that fight rigging deck. I don't love this deck. It's power seven or greater. Yep. Uh, rude. Rude and unusual. Unfortunately, that thing has reach also. We are gonna go for another Valkyrie. We just need to get our creatures to be massive from all these Righteous Valkyries. So they are doing a bunch of damage to us. I'm taking 14. Shh, I'll just take seven. This is a bit scary. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, another one, okay. I don't know if I can beat this, to be honest with you. Do I play a bishop and a youthful Valkyrie? I think I probably do. I am gaining a ton of life, but I do have an 810 now, which is, which is extremely not bad. I need to kill these things though. <laughs> uh, uh, omniscience. <laughs> Spooky. I don't know if I should let them draw a card. They're gonna draw a card anyway though. Uh, I'm gonna decline. I'm gonna block the Gargaroth. Okay, we're cycling, we're cycling. Okay, okay. What do they have off this omniscience? I'm mildly afraid. Just a bit. Okay. Uh, okay, it's not on to, yeah. I kind of have to win like right now though. Ooh. What are they gonna do with that? I think they might just be able to win the game by casting that. Let's see what they get. I'm pretty sure they can just win the game by casting it. Okay, okay, what do we got? <sighs> they can't have all runes epiphany. They can have the other two, I guess. They've already swung. Okay, yeah, they get it. Nah. <laughs> rude, rude, <laughs> unusual. One more game, we're two and two, and this is the tiebreaker. 
I like that deck. I am just so many wild cards off of making that fight rigging deck and it frustrates me because it looks like a lot of fun. I would love to be playing that. Um, so yeah, uh, subscribe to my channel, watch these videos, help me get my watch time up so I can apply for a YouTube partner so that I can buy more wild cards. Uh, 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 it's not my favorite. Mm, this is a bit better. This I will buy, Righteous Valkyrie. That was a good draw. They can absolutely counter this spell, and I assume they will. Sensor, sure enough. Probably uh, these control type decks are a really rough matchup for me on Angels. I don't imagine that this is ever really in my favor, um, but we're gonna do our very best. That looks like Absorb, doesn't it? I'm just gonna hold Coco and hope they don't try anything. I have a feeling they will counter it, though. But if they counter Coco on their turn, I can probably force a Johnny on my turn. What is the plan? They could have a board wipe, which is also, like, not good for me. Um, ooh. I'm gonna go for this. Because I like card draw here. And if they do wipe the board, I will get a single spirit, at least. <laughs> I'm gonna go for the real splendid angel, probably into a counter spell, but we'll see. Ooh, Wandering Emperor, okay, it's fine. Don't touch my resplendent angel, <laughs> please. <laughs> Leave her alone. I don't like this. Come on. Okay, all right. We are gonna go for the minus. Okay, they're gonna go for memory deluge. We get our cat and the center's tap. Fuck with my Ajani. Oh, that wasn't nice. I guess I could have swung with cave. Whoop, I did not do that. Next turn, next turn, 100%. They're looking at my cave. Stop looking at it. They think I have a collected company, probably. Rude. So this is gonna be a tough one to win. So this is my problem with angels. I just feel like I'm situated not fantastically. A lot, okay. Um, sure, I guess I'll go for Teferi. I feel like we're kind of out of this game. We've been outvalued. I keep trying to make angels work. I really wanted this deck to be good, and every time I play it, I have the same impression that it's just not there. It's just not good enough. All right, all right, we've been outvalued. I get it. I get it. Anyway. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know maybe the results weren't exactly what we were hoping for, but uh, I had fun playing it. I'm still hoping for angels to be really good. So if you have an angel list and you're like, this is the one, please send it my way because I'd love to see it. Anyway, thank you so much for stopping by and I'll see you guys in the next video.